This is Megan Healy with bceagles.com. We're here today with field hockey head coach Kelly Doten. With four games left in the regular season, what's your primary focus the next two weeks before the ACC championship? Uh, just keep getting better. You know, um, it was a tough weekend. You know, I, again, I don't think we played our best against UNH. They played very well. I think one of their best games that they had all season. And then going into uh, BU, again, what I told the girls is it's going to be a tough match. You know, energy is going to be needed for 70 minutes. And, you know, we went into overtime. You know, we had goal scoring opportunities. They had some goal scoring opportunities. And it's just really unfortunate that we didn't get the win there. But, you know, these last four games are important. We're in a do or die situation now. You know, these guys have aspirations to, to make it to the playoffs and make it to the NCAA tournament. And, you know, these four games are going to be critical. And, there's nothing easy about any of these four teams. You know, you got Wake on, on Friday who, um, you know, they're always tough. Any ACC opponent is going to give us a run for our money. And, you know, I think, um, you know, our non-conference schedule has, has provided a couple of hiccups for us. And, you know, again, I, I've said it before and I'll say it again, is that every non-conference team that comes in to play us wants to beat us really bad. You know, that's – it's – it's um, – you know, again, it, it was a tough weekend, and um, but now we're on to wake. What do you think has been the difference between home and road results this year? I don't know. I I think we play really, really well at home. They are so comfortable on that surface. It's obviously what we practice on. Um, you know, in the past, we've always done really well. We played well at home, and this year, I don't know why. You know, we're one and two against non-conference teams and we're away, you know, I think we're four and two or something on the road and, you know, with the ACC as well. But I'm not, I don't know. I, I, I'd like to think that they would choose to play at home over, you know, on the road, but it's not saying that we're playing terribly. It's just that the results aren't there. You know, we've been fixing the things that we've needed to fix. It's just, you know, we just haven't been able to put the ball in the back of the cage and haven't. Uh, been able to keep them out of our defensive circle. We we're, we're giving up way too many defensive corners, you know. And against good teams, they're going to have a really good attack battery, and we can't give them those goal scoring opportunities. And you know, I think hopefully um, on Friday they're going to we're going to have the result that we want, and that's going to be because we played that game at home. A win on Friday against Wake Forest would be your first three win ACC season as a coach, and the program's second in many years. What's key to success in the league play this year? I don't, I'm not thinking about that. I don't. I. I don't even know. Um, you know, we prepare these guys regardless who we play the same way. Um, you know, it's their responsibility to make sure that their bodies are ready to go and mentally and physically they're ready to go. I don't know. I don't. You know, the record it speaks for itself, I guess. But you know, whether it makes history or not, I don't really care at the end of the day. I just want to win. And, um, you know, I'm looking forward to the opportunity. I know these guys will too.